UDS TV, knowledge for service. UDS, a pride and a hope. The University for Development Studies, UDS, was established in 1992 as the premier university in northern Ghana. Currently, UDS has three campuses, the main campus based in Nyampala, as well as the city and Tamale campuses, both located in Tamale, the capital of the northern region of Ghana. The northern region is one of the 16 regions of Ghana. It is located in the north of the country and it is the second largest of the 16 regions. The UDS was established with a specific mandate to blend the academic world with that of the community in order to provide constructive interaction between the two for the total development of northern Ghana in particular and the country as a whole. The aim was to help accelerate the process of bridging the development gap between the north of Ghana and the south of Ghana. From a humble beginning, with just one faculty in 1993, UDS has steadily grown to become one of the best universities not only in Ghana, but in Africa. The student population of the university is 26,826. Regular students make up 82.5%, whilst sandwich students account for 0.7%. The rest, distance students, account for 16.8%. Out of this number, males are 49.3% and females make up 50.7% of the student population. Due to the quality and uniqueness of its programs, UDS has over the years been attracting international students drawn from different parts of the world. The Ghana Statistical Service reports that more than 70% of the northern population live in disadvantaged rural areas. The region scores lower than the south in most development terms in Ghana. Furthermore, the Ghana Poverty and Inequality Report, published by UNICEF in 2016, indicates that the northern region, with 1.3 million poor individuals, has the largest population of poor people in the country. The mandate of UDS is to facilitate a close relationship between academia and rural communities. And in doing that, the intention is to see how we can generate knowledge with the poor and use the same knowledge to design solutions to the rural challenge. To achieve one of its mandates of bridging the development gap, the University for Development Studies has over the years used partnerships with rural communities in its catchment area to bring about transformative, inclusive and sustainable development. The university uses its third trimester field practical program to deploy students as change agents and impact makers to rural communities for field practical training. The people are, are, are hospitable. Uh, they, they, they greet us every morning when you are passing by and a student or a native is passing by. You say hi, hello. Anybody that completes the UDS, wherever you are posted to, at least you have encountered such problems, but wherever you are posted to, you'll be able to work without any obstacle. It therefore comes as no surprise that in looking at poverty trends, the Ghana Statistical Service confirms that between 1992, when the UDS was established, and 2013, Ghana's national level of poverty fell by more than half, that is, from 56.5% to 24.2%, making Ghana the first country to achieve the MDG-1 in Africa. The poverty rate has continued to decline over the years, 
with the latest figures released in 2022 indicating a further reduction to about 20 percent. The UDS seeks to achieve its vision by promoting equitable and socio-economic transformation of communities through practically oriented community-based problem solving, gender sensitive and interactive research, teaching, learning and outreach activities, providing higher education to persons suitably qualified for and capable of benefiting from it, positioning itself as a national asset in the facilitation of lifelong learning developing its information and communication technology infrastructure as a driving force for the education of more people more rapidly and the improvement of efficiency and academic quality in order to advance community and national development. The UDS School of Business operates the Business Innovation and Incubation Center, also known as the BIIC, which seeks to develop the business acumen of students alongside academic training to enable them to take advantage of business opportunities available to them under the supportive environment provided by the University for Development Studies. The Vice Chancellor's Business Innovation Award Scheme is part of efforts by the BIIC to identify and support potential entrepreneurs among students of the UDS. The University for Development Studies, in collaboration with the University of Lincoln in the United Kingdom, initiated a project to explore replacing wheat with fonio to make bread. Fonio called the grain of life is among the 25 forgotten crops being rediscovered due to their many health benefits. It is a West African annual millet characterized by tiny seeds well adapted to hot and dry climates and thrives on marginal soils. Thus, with increasing adverse climate change and more lands becoming marginal and unsuitable for the cultivation of major grains, Fonio can come to the rescue as a food security crop. It is for this reason that the University for Development Studies is taking the lead to initiate this project to explore replacing wheat with fonio to bake bread and to produce other food items. Share Nut Roasting presents a potential opportunity to fight poverty. Unfortunately, most people, especially women, do this under very hazardous conditions. The University for Development Studies has in the past worked with UNIDO to fabricate a friendly share nut rooster to reduce the health hazards that rural women have to contend with in their share butter processing activities. The University for Development Studies has worked with the Government of Ghana and development partners such as the UK Government through Innovative UKKTP to provide sustainable solutions to our developmental problems and these include the recent fortified blended cereal to fight malnutrition in school children. have been many other innovations by the university that are impacting lives. Thus, the UDS model of university community partnerships for inclusive and sustainable development is therefore a success story that should be replicated especially across Africa, where academic institutions continue to exist largely as islands of knowledge with little impact on practice. UDS is interested in strengthening and sustaining its partnership with the University of York on a win-win terms in order to accelerate development. The UDS needs more support in order to continue to lead research in the production for local industry and exports. Yeah. Uh -huh.